Welcome to Excel Magic Trick number 1079. Hey, if you want to download this workbook and follow along, 1079 to 1080, click on the link below the video. Hey, in this video, we have a data dump with a text string that has letters and numbers. Now, we're going to use this same data dump of text strings in 1079 and 1080. In this one, all we want is a formula and a column to tell us whether they're under age or 18 or older. Now, it's pretty easy here because anytime we have four letters to start the text string, then we want under age. If there's six letters to start the text string, then we want 18 or older. So anytime you get a situation like this, you want to look through the data set and, and observe a pattern. Well, we know what the, the indicator is, but there's lots of ways we could trigger the if formula to put under age or 18 or older. I'm going to choose to count 5 in, extract just that one digit, and ask, is it a number? If it's a number, you're under age. If it's not, like right here, you're 18 or older. We'll use the mid function. That allows us to look at a text string. We can tell it, hey, start at character 5 and extract exactly one character. Control Enter, double click, and send it down. Now, notice the default alignment helps us understand what the mid function is spitting out. It's spitting out text because everything's aligned to the left. If I were to highlight this and highlight just the mid part and hit F9 to evaluate, that double quotes means it's actually not a number, it's text. If I were to wrap is number, is number looks at whatever's inside of that value and says, is it a number? It's going to be false all the way down. No problem. Here, we're simply going to take whatever mid, and by the way, that's a text function. Left, right, and other text functions are similar. They always spit out text. Any math operation on a number stored as text will convert it back to a number. I'm going to do plus 0, Control Enter, double click, and send it down. So if I were to go to Formula, Evaluate Formula, or the keyboard Alt-MV, and hit Enter to run this, or click Evaluate, Enter, Enter, we can see that it's a text. That math operation will convert it back, then is number says true. That will be our logical test. That whole thing goes inside the if function. There's our logical test. We come to the end. The value of true, which means it is number, which means there's four letters to start this off. We want under age. Otherwise, we want 18 or older. All right, Control Enter, double click, and send it down. Now, in this formula, we used is number. There's always many ways to do things in Excel. What if we had looked at this, which is converting the text string to a number and double clicked and send it down? Ah, there's a value. We could have chosen, instead of is number, to say is error. Control Enter. And in this case, the trues and falses would be reversed. That would still be our logical test. We'd come to the end, and 18 or older would be the value of true, and under age would be the value if false. Control Enter, double click, and send it down. All right, so that's how we went from a text string with four letters to start or six letters to start and either said under age or 18 or older. In our next video, we will actually extract the age of the person from this. All right, we'll see you next trick.